professional cricketer has gone on trial in the Hamilton District Court, accused of raping a woman after being out with her in May last year. Scott Kugeline, who's 24, plays for the Northern Knights, based in Hamilton. The woman he's charged with raping is 21. The crux of the case comes down to consent. Our Waikato reporter, Andrew McRae, has been in court and joins us now. Hi, Andrew. What can you tell us? Oh, good evening, John. Uh, the two met at a party. They then went into town to, to a bar and then went back to the, the woman's flat. Intimacy uh, developed. Uh, he indicated he wanted intercourse with her. Uh, she declined on a, a number of times. Uh, eventually, they both fell asleep. But on waking, they became pretty intimate again. And according to the Crown, uh, it ended up with him being on top of her, holding her wrists uh, and raping her. Uh, she told friends that night and the next day what had happened and then reported the incident to the police uh, a couple of weeks later. Andrew, the woman herself was the first witness, is that right? So what did she say? Uh, she told the, uh, the court that she was pretty intoxicated uh, by the time she went into town. Uh, they'd gone to a bar with others, but ended up just the two of them. Uh, she talked about going to the toilet at one point and falling asleep in, in a cubicle for a few minutes. Uh, she said she felt uh, comfortable with uh, Scott Krugerline and there were no problems at all. Later, they both went uh, to her flat in a taxi it was only much later, while they were in bed, that she said she started to become uh, feeling uncomfortable. Uh, they fell asleep at one stage, and then it's on waking. It's when the defendant, uh, she says, uh, raped her. Uh, she said uh, that she uh, was really confused afterwards, was in a daze and, and crying and didn't really know what to do. The day ended with uh, cross-examination by the defence. What happened during that? Well, Scott Krugerline's lawyer, Philip Morgan QC, asked the, the woman a number of questions about that evening. Uh, most of those uh, questions she couldn't uh, give an answer to, said uh, she couldn't recall what happened. Uh, one of them being a suggestion that uh, she had told friends earlier that she was keen on, on Mr Krugerline and that she was intending to take him home to bed. Uh, she agreed.